Hi guys, um, today is January 7th, I believe. It is Tuesday anyway, 2014. Um, it's 9.50 in the morning. I couldn't wait for them anymore. Um, I've been waiting a little over one year. I got this last year in December. Not the last Christmas we just had, but the previous one. So it's been over a year since they got this and they have never chewed through this, but I always knew there was stuff inside when I shook it. I always thought there was only a little bit of stuff in there, but it is jam packed full of stuff. So what I did was I took some, um, I took some pliers and I ripped this piece off. I just couldn't wait for these guys anymore. They obviously aren't interested in what's inside, but I guess as a human, I'm more interested, but um, I can't get it out without breaking this one, so I'm going to break it. Just give me one sec. She put a lot of glue on this, the breeder. Anyway, this is really cute. It's a snowman. I'm sure they'll eat this stuff once it's open. So let's see what else is in here. So there's um, bamboo. Uh, I think these are bamboo fingers or something like that. Um, there's a wooden coin. Another one. I know they'll like this one. Uh, there's a, currently a sale of this stuff. I'm going to go ask the breeder if I can um, prepay. Uh, I think it's like $10 a pound of coins and stuff. I'll prepay. Ask her to hold it because I plan to make a large order of a full bag of chinchilla dust. It's, I think, like... I don't know, $40, $50 for the bag. I plan to order that at the end of February along with like eight bags of hay. So it's going to be a very expensive order. So I might as well have her tuck this in instead of paying separate shipping. I don't know if she'll do it. I don't remember. But these are really cute. They're little snowflakes. And of course, there's this little thing. I don't know what this is. It's really cute. They like these. They've proven to me they really like these spools. They like, I think it's the shape. I don't know if it's the wood. I'll find out. And I, I would have bought some of these when I went to um, the States, but I changed my mind. But we'll see if they like it. They seem to shred these really, really fast. So because they bite it here and it just snaps the whole piece. Um, but anyway, there's a lot of toys. I'm going to put it back in here. And let them help themselves. I'm sorry, I just had to know what was in it. Um, I guess I can leave these in there. I'm sure they'll shred it now that it's accessible. I'm going to do this one too. Just give me a sec. Because as far as I am aware, they are different stuff. So that's why I'm doing it. Sorry guys, I just have to find a spot to sink my pliers in. <laughs> Easier said than done. Give me a sec more, guys. It's taking longer than I thought. <laughs> she did not leave any space on this one for me to sink anything in, so... Um... I can't figure out where to sink it in. This is the best spot. Give me another sec. I'll give it another try. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. So I just poked it, and then I just bent it and got it out. So I'll take this one off too. Once, once one of them is out, the other one's easy. So every one of these is different. I knew that when she gave them to me. I got one for free um, when I ordered over $100 of stuff, I believe. And then I got the other one in a Christmas uh, contest or prize draw or something like that. So... I won first place and I got some stuff. I did a video on that. So there's some treats in this one. I wonder if he would like it. Speedo's here, all the commotion. He's like, hmm. Oh, what did you like? What do you like? You like that? Mmm, good choice. Good choice. That's Nala's favorite. There's a lot of stuff in here. So this one has little pieces of wood. It's actually very creative. Uh, oh, I like this. Oh, I like this. Um, so while he's busy, there's another spool. Uh, so there's more of these little snowflake-looking things. 
um, and some herbs and stuff, or something like that. Let's see what else he likes. Oh, now you want to chew it. I think he just likes the glue. This is Speedo. He's in need of a dust bath, but I wasn't able to get him out of the cage today. I uh, ran into a little bit of a stumble with Nala. She refused to take cranberries this morning. So I had a little trouble giving her her antibiotic for a fungus treatment. Speedo ate his. Um, I end up having to hold her and shove it down her throat. She was not happy. Uh, she's upstairs right now. She's not happy with me. Is that good? Is that tasty? He's kind of like the child, the small child that likes to take a bite out of everything. Let's see if he'll eat this. Mmm. Maybe not. <laughs> the wood's more tasty than the supplement. Mind you, the supplement's been there for a while. He does like this. Yeah, he does like rose hips. Is that good? Mmm. How about this? Mmm. Would you like a bite of the snowman? Hello. Nice to meet you. Ah. Ah. Ah, he's going for my face. Ah. Ah, wrinkles. <laughs> ah, my head. Ah. Ah. <laughs> He's just having a blast. There's so many new toys. I should have opened this a long time ago. Um, she sells this, I believe, for $10. 8 to $10. He's stepping on the snow. <laughs> what are you finding in there? Oh, you like that? You like that? Mm. He really likes bark. So I think I'll just leave them like this. Um, if they don't chew this, I, I, if this works out, I'm going to ask her. Uh, I will take a photo of this after the video is done. But what I would like to do is ask her to make me one in a longer shape. And then I would like to mount it. Or I guess I could make my own. But what I really would like is to make something similar to this with three-sided. And then I would like with the two sides of the corner and I would like to mount it to here and I would like to make it into a toy box for them to get the stuff. So that means in the morning when I clean up, all I have to do is pick up everything and throw it into the container and then they can get it out of the uh, container on their own. My only problem with making it is I need some way of cutting this wood into this height because right now it's too deep for them to lean up and over and in because I have to hang it. Unless I hang it like starting from here and it reaches down here. Otherwise, if the container's right here, they're not going to be able to go up and over. Um, but that's my plan. I will eventually do that. I've been wanting to do something very similar because I want to do it with chew sticks and stuff. I, I'm so sick of cleaning up the things over here. For example, like all these little half buttons and stuff. I don't want to vacuum up because they'll eat it. They'll still chew it. But it gets to be a hassle when you're trying to pick up all these things on top of all the bits and pieces that they shredded of the chew sticks. So it would be nice to be able to make them a toy box that I can put their toys in. But Speedo ran away because I scared him when I moved too fast, I guess, in the cage. But I will put back everything in here so it doesn't make too much of a mess and they don't pee on it by accident. But I will put it here. And um, I'll just leave it there for him. Anyway, I gotta go clean downstairs. I'm in the middle of cleaning, actually. I was just too curious. Um, so I'll just show you the bottom. This side, not too bad. That side is uh, uh, uh. So I will go clean it and then refill their stuff. You guys wanna see what's in there? Oh, what a mess. It'll be perfectly clean by the time I'm done though. I'll just stick a hose in there and clean it. And I don't know what's in this one, but I'm assuming it's pretty nasty. I can't see it, guys, but I hope you guys can. But that's the reality of having chins. That's what it looks like. Okay, guys?